Well, a nice kick by him. So we've had uh, ten and a half minutes gone. It's Scotland three and the Barbarians five. Useful restart kick by the Barbarians, and they might just have uh, regained it. Leonard tries to winkle it out. Now Jenkins, good flat pass. Satala, who's very strong indeed, and kicks out of a tackle. There's a typical Fijian one-handed piece of play. Perry needs some help. Ruben Kruger, the uh, springbok, is there. Scott Gibbs doing a flanker's job, and he's won it. Howley, Jenkins, Delalio on the burst. Taken by Scotland's two props. McElwham and Jacobson. A little bit of a readjustment there by Videri, who came in from the right wing. Scotland still under fierce pressure from the Barbarians. Zinzan Brook, now Howley. Plenty of enterprise and still decent Scots defence. Didier Minnie's looking uh, to see if the Scots are offside. Back inside to Zinzan Brook. Great Scots defence there. Still the black and white jerseys trundle forward. Jason Leonard. That was a bit too quick even for Rob Howley. That's a nice dummy by the former Welsh skipper. Well, Luger on a little arcing run, but he hasn't got enough uh, room on that far side. But again, they make it available. This has been terrific continuity by the Barbarians. Highly waits. Now Jenkins. This is Videri. Immensely strong. And that's a lovely pass. And it's Perry for the second Barbarians try. And again, that Southern Hemisphere sleight of hand has set up an Englishman for a try. And that was simplicity itself. It's all about creating the space and trying to just get a little penetration across the gain line. Well, it's not only sleight of hand. Vidiri here, pass off Neil Jenkins. There's nothing on here. Vidiri has a look. Look at that. Takes the contact and a lovely flip pass there to Matt Perry, who hits the ball on an angle and dots down between the posts. But Vidiri's showing not only sleight of hand. Look at this one-handed pass out the tackle backhanded flip hits Perry but that also comes from the power to stand up in the tackle and I think it underlines the fact that in modern rugby you can't just go around the waist or around the legs you've got to try to stop the ball being passed absolutely and obviously with the Barbarians stringing through what eight nine ten pieces of play there against a lateral defense it ended up with Matt Perry going between the posts good play by the Barbarians and the conversion this time by Neil Jenkins and we'll have another look at that. I mean, he was right down on his knees and that massive hand offloaded the balls. Of